Monday Night Raw is back in Glendale, Arizona. And after almost walking out of his match with The Miz last week, but being stopped by Coffee Kingston, softy Seth Rollins doesn't want to wait till Money in the Bank to get his hands on Coffee and has been granted a match with him tonight in a non-title match. Also tonight, Luke Gallows prepares for another title defence in the United States Open Challenge. Becky Lynch faces Trish Stratus. And tonight is the last chance for Raw Superstars to get in the Money in the Bank ladder match in a six-man battle royal up next. Here we go. This battle royal is underway. And guys, it's hot outside here tonight in Arizona, but it's even hotter inside for this one. Oh, I think this man means business. How do you see him getting it done here tonight? Now this is what I like. Nothing compares to members of the WWE locker room getting in there and letting fists fly. And remember, only one can be victorious. Drop kick delivered with precision. 
Daniel Bryan stalling a bit here. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. I don't know where his head is right now, guys, but it doesn't seem to be focused on winning this battle royal. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. Whoa, did you see what he just did? Incredible! Cactus Jack starting to stammer some. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. This is certainly trending in the wrong direction for him, guys. He's going to have to get it together if he wants to win this battle royal. He's certainly in a tough spot here, guys, but there's still plenty of time. Plus, it's not like his opponent is running away with this thing. Well, at least not yet, anyway. And he lands a savage elbow. A brutal clothesline catches in the perfect spot. Not the first time we've seen this move tonight. No, he reverses it. And it's Cactus Jack with the reversal. Chad Gable not looking himself right now. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. The good news for him is that everybody gets at least a little beat up in a battle royal. That's just the nature of the beast. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. Yeah, he can turn it on in the blink of an eye. He clearly did his homework heading into tonight. Is it not so fast direct hit work is being put in by Daniel Bryan down he goes that'll do it every time oh and he's still down Byron things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now he's showing some aggression with that elbow he's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here What could Jason Jordan do now to get the ball rolling again? This match is definitely testing his metal, guys. With so much mass in the ring at the same time, bodies have a way of getting beaten and broken, and that's exactly what's happening to him right now. At this point, they both look to be about evenly matched. Maybe I'd give him an edge, but not by much. All this demoralizing damage to Chad Gable. How can he take the upper hand here? I don't think this is how he envisioned this match going here tonight. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. Flips the script on him there. Tapped his jack with a nice reversal. Made him pay there. Now we have Daniel Bryan on the attack. Daniel. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Saw that one coming. He's flipped the switch, that's for sure. He's making a statement here with this attack. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. He's in trouble. I don't think he should get up. Jason Jordan is in trouble and hurt right now. And I'm not sure he even knows where he is. This one could go either way, guys. It might just come down to which superstar is the next to make a mistake. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Jason Jordan is in a real bad spot. And Jason Jordan reverses it. <laughs> Tapped into an energy source and he's going strong. the clothesline.
Now we have Daniel Bryan on the attack. Daniel Bryan measuring his man center of the ring. Boom! Oh, this could be over. Looks like Bryan's going to be our winner here, guys. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Man, Jason Jordan, what offense. Jason Jordan is on the attack. Bryan is not playing right now. And his elbow finds the mark. And Daniel Bryan. Oh, look at the hamstring, and here come the yes kicks. Yes! Yes! I love these, Michael. One more for good measure. <laughs> Can he finish him off here? Boy, he is rolling. And Jason Jordan reverses it. Jason Jordan is on the attack. The final elimination. Here is your winner, Jason Jordan. And there's the last one standing. What a match. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. And I can imagine there aren't too many people at home regretting tuning in for that amazing match. Wow. Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. It'll be Kofi Kingston against Seth Rollins. Oh, we are going anywhere. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Up and over with the monkey flip. Just toying with the competition a little. For some competitors, part of their strategy is to demean their opponent. A move like that says it all. That move at this juncture of the match makes the intention unmistakable to belittle. Great offense by Kofi Kingston. Just making his presence felt there. We've seen this before. Here's Seth Rollins. Lightning fast reflexes. Kobe Kingston looks stunned by that. 
Jackson ever got into the ring, and this one is over before it could begin. If you ask me, the officials need to be a little more lenient with the rules when it comes to big matches like this. We got one-on-one -on -one action coming your way next. We have Becky Lynch against Trish Stratus. kick this one off. Look at this power. She's just so dominant. Becky Lynch with the offense. Tell us about Becky Lynch. You're the expert. What does she need to do to win here? Remember, guys, Becky Lynch has been training for this since the age of 15, which means while she might be in her prime, she carries with her years of invaluable experience. One thing I can say about her is if she does get beat, it won't be because of a lack of preparation or effort. She's wasting no time taking over this contest. Comes up big with the reversal. She turns it around on her. Oh, the reversal by Trish Stratus. Wow, is there nothing she can't do? Stratus is not someone to sleep on. A quick finish. Can she do it? Kicks out in time. Going to take more than that to take down the Irish last kicker, folks. Yeah, I love the effort here, but she'd better hope she can sustain it. Oh, man, she is rolling now. Got the reversal. Comes up big with a reversal. And she escapes the submission. Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. Now we have trip. That can't be enough, can it? Oh, the reversal by Trish Stratus. Kick, kick. Is it enough to put Becky away? This should do it right there. One, two. Oh, man, what a near fall that was. She kicked out there, but I don't know how much more she can take. She's practically motionless right now, Corey. And she's probably wondering what she's got herself into right about now. Trish is absolutely on fire right now. The drop on did some damage and this has got to be it she might just be running on instincts at this point right now I just don't know what it's gonna take she appears to be in complete control of this one uh oh she's not getting up just pin her this match is over Trish is absolutely on fire right now. Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. Oh, the reversal 
by Trish Stratus. Going to have a hard time stopping Becky when she's doing this. Watch out. Wow, what a slam. Don't let the beauty fool you. She Will this be it? Oh, that was close, so close. This is amazing. Targeting the back now. Big reversal for her there. A kick to the gut. That'll double you over. Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. She is on fire. Oh, and she has an answer for that one. This could do it. No, oh, she's got a tremendous amount of resilience, so I think she's got some something left here. Yeah, Becky Lynch's heart continues to beat loud and strong, staying alive in style here. a punishing DDT. Wisely bringing the action back into the ring. Okay, now she's just showing off. Becky Lynch with the offense. She's in a bad way here. Bottom line, she's got to get up. She can't win this match on her back. Here she goes, back in the ring now. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. Now that one well scouted. She can end it here. One, and the shoulder's up. That's why she's considered Canada's greatest export, folks. She's off on that one, Corey. You can say that again. I don't think Trish should be showboating right now, but <laughs> what do I know? She got her with a reversal. No, there's the reversal. Ah, oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. Becky Lynch is looking for the ending. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so, and she's able to break out of it. The lesson to learn here, Cole, is that you can never count her out. Going to have a hard time stopping Becky when she's doing this. Now we have Becky Lynch on the attack. It could be over here. One, two. Becky Lynch wins. Here is your winner, Becky Lynch. And Becky Lynch walks away with the win. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. The wait is over. This one's for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship.
for the WWE United States Championship on the line here. You can bet these superstars brought their A game with them tonight. Oh, without a doubt, Michael, this match is huge, and these superstars know exactly what's at stake here. We're just moments away from the United States Championship being defended here tonight. This is the match I've been most looking forward to, Cole. It seems every time the United States Championship is on the line, the superstars just give it that much more. Stay right where you are, people. Here's the bell, and here's Sami Zayn looking to unleash some brutality early. And this capacity crowd is on its feet right now. They can tell they're about to witness something amazing. But can he knock off the champ here tonight? There's a lot of people who say he can't, but I actually kind of like his chances. Well said, gentlemen. And it sounds to me like this is the match this Glendale crowd has been waiting for. Moving up through the ranks in impressive fashion, we get to see Sami Zayn in the matchup once again. What, if anything, can he do to overthrow the current champion? Leading up to this international championship, these two superstars might have held back, not wanting to tip their hands. But now it's time to use every trick in the book, and they know it. He's really putting his athleticism on display here. Sami Zayn starting to struggle. As the number one contender, you can bet he's the envy of so many in the locker room. He seemed more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Second time's a charm. Oh, he's able to reverse it. seen and heard tonight there must be serious injuries sent into the ropes with the snake eyes tough luck there oh no a counter Be wondering where he is after that flip. Got him good with the elbow there. He'd better hope he can sustain this. And there's the reversal from Luke Gallows. Look, Luke Gallows is on the attack now. He might have it. Choke slam! He's back in control here. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. He knows he's in trouble. Luke Gallows is going in for the kill. Shoot Bob! Here's his moment, Michael. There's the pan. Ken is upon a kick out. Two, three. The champ retains.
a very impressive victory. To get the pinfall victory over such a high quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. Boy, I don't think we're going to have too many disappointed viewers at home. Not with action like we just saw.